And welcome to the Not So Daily Crisps. I am in Caledon today, my home and native land, and we are shooting some photos for the National Ballet's current campaign, 150 points across Canada. I've got my trusty little camera here. We're gonna shoot some pictures. Not just any pictures, pictures, hold on, pictures of point shoes, 150 points across Canada. Here we go. First location is a section of the Caledon Trailway. I take my bike down here quite a bit. Did you guys see that? It scared the hell out of me. I have no idea what the hell that bug was, but it kept freaking biting me. Man, these Caledon bugs, horse flies. We're in horse country. You can definitely be a horse fly. So we've moved from the 35 kilometer Caledon Trailway Trail to the Caledon Hills Farm. We are at a nice little farm on St. Andrews. Let's see if that shoe's gonna stay. From St. Andrews and the Grange Road, it's one of my favorite golf courses. Now tell me this isn't gonna be a cool shot. A point shoe growing in a field? What? In the car for our next stop of the journey we are headed to the best spot in Caledon to watch the sunrise not just any sunrise the sunrise over our beautiful city of Toronto all right here from the top of the Caledon Hill join me shall you <laughs> Thank you. 
Yes, I just drove out of the ditch. Did you know that Rapunzel's tower is actually hiding in the Caledon Hills? There it is. Rapunzel's tower. Well, here it is. The most beautiful lookout point in Caledon Hills. That's not it, even though that big rig is pretty cool. Not truck and convoy across Caledon. That's the nursery truck. That's bringing a lot of cool trees. It's filled with trees. Let's get our pictures done. for that long? Holy cow. All right, come watch what I'm doing over here. This is not a Sotheby's ad, but this house is freaking amazing. 11 million overlooking the city of Toronto, on the top of the Caledon Hills. This is the best estate, 11 million. Gotta see the pool. Martha Stewart actually attended a party here. Martha, my friend Martha. And here we are from Horseshoe Hill Road in the escarpment. It's gorgeous, right? Look at this. Absolutely breathtaking. different. Am I right? Am I right? You remember when I almost fell through the ice? That was close. I wouldn't fall through the ice today. I'd fall into the nice, cool, refreshing Credit River. And that's where we are. The Credit River flowing right through Forks of the Credit. I bring the girlies here every season, winter, spring, summer, fall, to experience all the colors, the sounds, the feeling of the water in the winter and the summer. Gorgeous, isn't it? Oh, my friends love a low rider. Low rider is a little higher.
quick little stop at the Bell Fountain Community Center to check out the Calden Library Holds lockers. Let's see what they look like. Wow, these are nice. So you order your books online. They get sent to these hold lockers where you put in your card and it drops the books. Pretty cool. Actually, really cool. Now Caledon, without a doubt, is horse country. And a horse country cannot have an epicenter. This is the epicenter of horse country in Caledon. The Grange Equestrian Neighborhood. We're right here on Mississauga Road and the Grange Side Road, in the epicenter, the heart, the core of Caledon's horse community. Get on your horse and let's go. Giddy up. that was but what I will say is that that is probably the best equestrian facility in Caledon one of the best Make sure to link up 150 points across Canada from the National Ballet so you can see my pictures. And really, don't forget to tell me where you want to film. Just write that below. Write that below. The next story, let me know. Write it below. And that's it. Thank you everyone for tuning into another episode, a very special episode of the Not So Daily Chris. One where I, Chris, took you around Caledon to shoot some photos for 150 points across Canada celebrating the National Ballet and Canada's 150th birthday. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for tuning in. It means a lot to me. Make sure to subscribe. Subscribe! Make sure to subscribe. 
and let me know where you think I should film next. Boston Mills Cemetery. I'm not exactly sure why I stopped here, but I'm here. I like to make it a point of stopping in some type of new location in Caledon, somewhere that I've never been before. And I've, I, I've passed this Boston Mills Cemetery before on Boston Mills Road, but I've never actually just come in here and checked it out and looked around just pulled in all of the Caledon history that's in here. All of these people that have passed away, but have made some type of impact on our town. It really is a gorgeous place, especially on a day like today. And that's what kind of got me thinking just now. I'm doing this thing for the National Ballet with 150 points across Canada, where everybody submits their pictures with a point shoe, where those involved in the project submit their photos, where they're from with the point shoe, just to promote where they live. And I got to thinking, maybe this is crazy. Maybe. But I think, I think I should do 150 points across Caledon. Where I stop at 150 locations across Caledon. What do you think? 150 points across Caledon? Might be crazy. 150 vlogs talking about Caledon where I stop at places like this, the Boston Mills Cemetery, give you a little bit of history, show you what it's like, take you for a tour. Might be coming soon. Think about it. I'm gonna think about it. I'm gonna be asking you guys what your favorite places in Caledon are. And I might just stop in. Talk about the money, always talk about the honey, baby. Oh, my brother's here. What's your name? What's your name? Take it down to the river, take it with a pinch of salt. Whatever the game is, good. it's not my fault. Devil, take my soul if you want it. Bring it back to me for just one more night. Take my soul if you want it Bring you back to me for just one more night Well, I made a deal with your mama Made a deal with your pa We can make a deal, baby Take my
I'm slow.